Hey there again YouTube and in this video I'm going to teach you guys how to add video files onto your iPod Touch, Nano or Video. Now I know this is very easy, most of you guys already know how to do this, but you have to put in mind that not everybody knows how to convert a movie file to the appropriate iTunes format. So this is the reason why I'm making this video tutorial to teach the people that don't know how to do this. So um, alright let's get started. The first thing that we need in order to um, start adding video files onto your iPod touch or nano or whatever is download a video converter so we're going to do that right now we're going to down we're going to download a video converter called any video converter okay so we're going to go to download.com okay then when you're on the website okay once you're on the website you're going to see a search bar at the top click that and type in any video converter okay and then search okay after it's finished searching uh, you're gonna see a whole bunch of results just click the first one that says any video converter 2.6.7 then download that one okay just go to the right side and click download now and then it should say thank you for downloading any video converter blah 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 and then just wait for the um, file to pop up okay here it is when you see this click save file and you should see the setup downloading uh, since I already have mine downloaded I don't have to do this again so yeah I'm not gonna download that again so uh, basically when yours is finished you're gonna double click the file after it's done after it's done it should look like this just double click it okay and then the setup should open just continue through the setup keep on clicking next and then yeah just basically go through the setup and install the program once you're done installing the program just open it up you should have an icon on your desktop so open up the program and um, it should look like this okay okay now the very first thing you want to start doing to uh, start adding movies onto your iPod touch or whatever you want to convert the movie file whatever movie files you have you want to convert them to mp4 because uh, any video files that are not mp4 iTunes is not going to accept them and your iPod is not going to accept them so you have to make sure the video file is mp4 okay so I'm gonna teach you guys how to convert your video files into mp4 right now okay first off you're gonna wanna find your video file okay you just go to any folder where your uh, your video is located and make sure your any video converter is open you're gonna find your video okay so I'm just gonna click any video here All right, I'm gonna click the Rickroll video okay alright then you're just gonna drag the video to the window here the um, any video converter window you see where my cursor is you just drop it into the window okay now your file should show up like this okay when you see a check mark and your file that means it's ready to um that means you're ready to encode your video to the appropriate format um yeah you're ready to encode your video to a format different format okay so um now since you have your uh, file here, when you have your file here, you're going to want to go up to the top right where it says profile, okay? You're going to click the drop down menu and you're going you're to scroll down all the way to the bottom where it says customize mp4 movie. You're going to click that, okay? You just simply click customize mp4 movie, make sure that's there. And you want to make sure your file is checked right here, make sure there's a check mark. And you're going to simply click encode, okay? So it's gonna start encoding you wanna wait until uh, yeah you're gonna wait until it's finished you're gonna wait until it's finished okay well I'm not gonna wait for it again just yeah just to just to save time let me see how do I stop this uh, okay whatever alright well anyway when it's done when it's a hundred percent you're gonna go down to output folder okay and then when you click output folder it should show you the video that you just converted okay so for example since you're on customized mp4 movie since you're customizing I mean since you're uh, converting your file into mp4 movies when you open the output folder it should show a whole bunch of the mp4 movies that you um, that you've converted so basically this is where you'll find all your new movies okay so once you have your movie converted in your folder in, in the output folder you're gonna open up iTunes, okay? 
then um, once you have iTunes open, click movies. Simply click movies right here on the left side, and then you're gonna open up the output folder that we just uh, that I just showed you right now. You're gonna simply take the video file and drag it into the um, the movie playlist in into your iTunes. Okay, so you're just gonna drag it and drop it like that. Okay, and the uh, video file should show up. But since I didn't convert my Recroll movie to MP4, it's not gonna show up. But when you do that, the video will show up in your um, your movies playlist. And then all you have to do is simply go to your iPod. Okay, let me see. Um, actually, I'm not gonna connect my iPod right now. It'll save more time. Well, anyway, it, you just go to your iPod, and then click movies, and then click sync, and then that's all you have to do. And then you should have your um, your movies on your iPod Touch or whatever and that's basically all you have to do to get movies on your iPod Touch Nano or video it's very simple okay well I hope you guys enjoyed this video tutorial and I hope it helped you guys out and um, thank you guys for watching my video tutorial again and take care